So the rest of the children are with the accident are in Missouri. They're not in the city of Richmond. I am the person that got hurt in the city of Richmond and is from the city of Richmond. But because I traveled to DC and Maryland, you know, if I'm in cruciating pain, you know, I have to handle the situation. But I was at the concert on YouTube doing sound language because I ain't know how to dance to the music. So sound language just seemed like it just fit the description of where I was at. And basically when they were on the stage um, speaking, I was doing the sound language. And so I don't know if that um, I still don't think you're supposed to uh, glide into anybody though. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just basically do praise dancing. I do, you know, on occasion, depending on music, what dance to the music. But, um, I don't know. It was just one day at a concert looking at YouTube sound language, and I was doing the sound language that goes with the video. And they were stating... Uh, basically the video I thought it was kind of odd but you know uh, <clears throat> I've stopped with the um, learning sound language because they like scarred me you know for real but it did make me think like how could I um, help the people that does sound language or uh, people that are deaf or hard of hearing what would be things in which I could do to um help them, you know, like we all have our own struggles, you know, and so I was learning sign language, like one day I went into a Henrico hospital, one of their hospitals, and um, it was a lady and a girl, I got like her niece or something, and they were um, doing sign language, and I was like, well, I remember doing that in high school, and um, I was in the little sign language club, and I thought to myself, like, I want to learn how to do sign language. So I was taking out um, time out of my day to, to learn sign language with YouTube. And I went to the Richmond Coliseum with the VCU homecoming in 2018. And I wanted to see, like, because I couldn't, I, I didn't know how to jam to their music. I went to um, YouTube and started doing sign language to the music. And it was like one beat where I could, you know, um, learn the sign language. So I was very proud of myself, but I ain't proud of this pain. And I just really didn't think like, you know, you see somebody doing sign language and you try to knock them to the floor, you know? Um, I do appreciate all the sign language people do this on YouTube because I did learn a whole lot. I had to be get on rhythm, you know what I'm saying, with the, um, like a really, a, a, like, really get on rhythm with the music to do the sign language with the music. But I am very proud of myself for um, learning sign language. You never know on what day something may happen to you where you have to learn sign language. You know what I'm saying? Um, and YouTube is a very good place to learn it. Because I basically did the whole YouTube video uh, of sign language in the Richmond Coliseum um, before I started sliding across the floor. I can't tell you that an angel saved me. You know? Now, the young men, they're from Missouri. Ain't no telling where they're at in the United States of America right now. But they're in the same pain that I'm in, if not worse, um, of nerve pain. And as you pray for me, please pray for them. And I do know that VCU will get to the bottom of it.